instruments beats fluke and Klein. This is from the new Harbor Freight catalog. And apparently they are getting in every trade. Electricians, HVAC contractors, true RMS multimeter. Model DM1000 beats model MM700. Does one or two things different from Klein's and it's $30 less. So, and we got Ames beat flukes, fork meter. 60 bucks compared to buck 20. Model T5600, model CM200A. This is what, 100 amps, 200 amps, 600 volts, resistance 100 down, capacitance none, temper range none. Contact voltage, work light. So this does a bunch of different stuff. This does like four or five things different from this one. But just because it has more features doesn't mean it's true, you know? That's the thing about multimeters and just meters in general. You want true RMS. Fifty bucks, ninety bucks. One twenty. These are pretty big numbers for Harbor Freight multimeters. I mean, you can get fluke meters for this. You just gotta look around for for deals. No, you get 10%, $10 off any meter. And it comes with carrying cases. Some flukes don't. Some do. You gotta buy a lot of fluke accessories uh, separate. This looks like they come with their accessories already. But who am I to knock Ames and Harbor Freight? They're stepping their game up, man. They're, they're hitting every trade. And especially the electrical trade, they definitely stepping up. They're going against Klein, Fluke, Channel Lock, everyone. Now they're going against Blue Point. You got Skinners, Live Data. thing is, I don't know, it's, almost 200 bucks for a scanner and Harbor Freight, that's kind of tough, you know what I mean? I'm going to blow a buck 20 on a plant meter from Harbor Freight, it's kind of tough, you know? I'm afraid it's supposed to be budget wise. And like bootleg things. I mean, there's a, there's a few things in Harbor Freight that are amazing, you know? And then there's a bunch of things that aren't. But yeah, they're definitely stepping up on the electrical trade. Whoever gets in their way. You know. I'm not gonna go through the whole catalog because you got other people that do it and are more and more entertaining than I am. <laughs> but this is what I'm talking about. Doyle beats Klein. Bremen beats Irwin. But as you can see, you know, they're coming out with insulated electrician pliers. 
Mm -hmm. They're definitely coming after the whole electrical world. They are stepping their game up. Oh man, the prices are, you know. A couple dollar more, you can get the real, real deal coins. Even Milwaukee, man, their hands are off the hook. You know, you don't have to get clean. Snap on. But I definitely want to try these, man. I want to try one of these. I need a SDS hammer. And I don't got 300 bucks to buy a cordless one. You know? But I like this one. I'm going to try those out. That's how it is, man. It's your final attempt to step your game up into the electrical world, guys. I don't know. What do you think? Like, comment, subscribe. I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.